This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics. We're selling this Trailblazer on eBay and elsewhere. Uh, it is hot. <laughs> no, actually, it's uh, Friday, June 17th, 16th, and it's about uh, 11 in the morning. It's about 101, 102 degrees. And I'm in front of an 04 Chevy Trailblazer. It is a leather extended. It's the EXT. Uh, it has a third seat. It is four-wheel drive. It's the uh, 4.2 liter uh, motor. Um, it has 52,000 miles. It is a theft recovery uh, due to theft, uh, salvage title due to theft, um, not due to collision. Purchased out of San Diego. Insurance company, for whatever reason, did not want to give it a clean title. They uh, probably have been getting sued too much. So you just threw the car into the bus. It's got some very minor cosmetic stuff that uh, obviously they push someone with this bumper right here. <laughs> you can see it's kind of spidered. But uh, really nice rig. Tires are at about, I don't know, 30 or 40 percent. Yeah, maybe, yeah, 30 or 40 percent is about right. Um, see a road rash there. I think they're pretty much all right to drive a long distance if you wanted to come here and pick it up and pay dock fee and restore fee and all that stuff. Um, if you want to ship it, you just pay whatever your high bid was or whatever the agreed upon price is and we're good to go. Passenger side looks fantastic. see a brand new spare under there which is unusual we don't guarantee spares or jacks or anything like that but if we have one we'll let you know it's there they didn't steal that it's got a little tiny hole in this lens but it's like not where the light is so it's not going to affect anything I'm not really sure how that happened got a little chip right there scuff there Let's see. Let me get my sign out of the way here. Alright. We didn't get any touch up paint for it. If we got some touch up paint for it, 99% uh, of this would be better. But we kind of like you to see it the way we see it. So you know exactly what we saw when we bought it. Anyway, it looks like we got a little rub right there, but there's no body damage there at all. It looks like. Just a little tube of touch-up paint would do it. There's a chip here. The molding has a little owie on it. Looks like there might be a little ding down low. I don't know if you can see that in the video. It's pretty, pretty light, but I'll try to disclose everything. There you go. All right, let's open the hood here. I just, uh, we've had this thing running for about two hours. We always let them run for quite a while before we do a video. Just to, you know, it's already been checked out by our mechanics, but we want to make sure that there's no leaks, it doesn't overheat, anything like that. So it's been running for a while. As you can see, these are the factory fenders. No collision damage, repair, or any of that crap. There's your 4.2 liter motor. As you can tell, it's running. Very quiet. This fender is all fine. Anyway, it looks fantastic under the hood. Everything's where it's supposed to be. Everything's original and factory. Right. Let's see. Let's run back here to the back of the vehicle. First I'll take you to the third seat. There's your third seat, which looks great. I mean, really nice leather. Usually on Chevy leather we have to do a lot of repair work and whatever, cause I, but uh, I think whoever owned this thing took pretty good care of it, and I think it's probably worst days were those day or two where it was not with them. 
after it was stolen. Um, here's your door panel. There you go. Here's your. There's really nothing going on here. You got your controls for the air, the rear air, which is blowing here and there, and then you got for the third seat. this up make sure that we've got air coming out of there yes we do so anyway there's your air let's see let me put my sign back away here we're trying to get a new process going here we have to put these signs in here because people like to steal our ads and then try to uh, pretend like they own the car it's bizarre Anyway, so we keep a sign around and all these pictures, full car pictures, so that the scammers know that they're not welcome. All right, there's that. There's the number that California gave it. It's the actual VIN number of the car. They stole the VIN off the dash. They give it a reassigned VIN number, um, which is the VIN number for this vehicle. The door panels look great. The only thing we had to do to this car at all was we dyed this seat. It had it had like it wasn't cracked through, but it had big lines, like big black lines through the seat and on the bolster. And so we kind of dyed it and kind of filled it just a little bit, just so it wouldn't crack through all the way. There's a little bit of wear right here on the back. All right. Oh man, it's hot. Die, it's so freaking hot today. Actually, people, this is sort of sissy weather, really. I think it's a lot hotter than. <laughs> there it is, 104. Anyway, you do have OnStar. You'd obviously have to subscribe to it, but there it is right there. Uh, la, la, la. You've got CD, you've got air, you've got your rear air fan controls. You've got your rear windshield wiper controls. Let's see, what else do we need to show you here? The dash looks great. Usually they have a little peeling. The, the die likes to uh, peel on Chevy and GMC stuff, and there's none of that here. So I would say this car spent a lot of time indoors um, at night. Let's see. There's all your lights and stuff. There's your tilt wheel up and down. There are your miles right there, 51328. See if I can get some more shade on this so you can see better. There you go. Great uh, oil pressure is perfect. Um, temperature is perfect. This thing's been running for a long time, sitting with no air running through the radiator at all, and it's sitting right in the middle. Perfect. Let's see, what else? We do have a remote. There's your remote. Let's uh, put it in neutral put it into all four-wheel drive, which is sort of the rainy weather driving. Put it in reverse, and I put it in drive, and yes, it does that. I put it in four-wheel high. A little more traction for weather driving. That's drive, there's reverse. Perfect. Let's put it in the low. Boom, put it in drive bang that is definitely low feel the torque in a big way there and reverse and we're going backwards and we're good all right let's put it in two wheel high and go on a real quick drive and we will be set tilt the wheel down a little bit all right whoo it is hot 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 anyway this is a nice rig guys um fact this, I was going to take our Armada home, but this is a little easier to drive. It's not as big, and it still has three seats, and we're going to the pool all weekend. So, I think I'm going to take this one. Beautiful running car. Very, very quiet, very smooth shifting. Um, I don't see anything wrong with this car other than some very minor cosmetics, which I would just get a touch-up stick for. Check it out. Bid quick. Thank you.